Welcome to Shiny Union, and these are my final four cameras. So I bought on a lot of cameras in the past, and these are my four ones that I use the most, and are probably gonna be the four ones that I have for a long time, just because this channel's ending, and I don't need to buy like a billion cameras a year. So um, these are the four cameras, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's gonna be in different locations, as well as here. The camera I use the most is a camera I have on me all the time, and that's the iPhone 5S. I do Flickr, I do Instagram, I do slow-mo, I do video, pretty much do everything with this little guy. I have a lot of accessories and adapters, but I use it uh, like this with a simple case, um, no special lenses or anything, all the time. I don't really use the digital zoom, I use it pretty far wide and just walk in and walk out. But since I have it on me all the time, I can use it, and um, it's really fun to have, it's really fun to play with. And there's so many apps and stuff, so you can do so much with this, so my most used camera, probably my favorite is my phone. So my number two most used camera is the one that I use on weekends and I use for all my trips and it's the Canon T4i. I also have the Canon T3i. And when I started out shooting video, I started out on my iPhone, then I went to the Olympus EPL1, then ended up with this guy and this guy has been the best. I've tried out other brands like Nikon, but um, I've always come back, and my backup buy is actually the one before this one, the T3i, which is pretty good. And um, the one thing that make this great, and how why I would tell people to start out here, is because it has the STM motors in the T4i. That means that you can get these lenses, the STM lenses, and I have three of them right now. Super smooth, focusing, really quiet, and for video it's just incredible because you can like point and click on your screen. Another good thing about this camera, flip out screen, so when I'm doing videos, it's kind of perfect. It's made for video, so it has a mic in, um, I w and I really use this one all the time. Can't recommend it enough. Okay, so you can shoot. My third most used camera is Olympus OM-1, and the story behind this is pretty cool. I um, got this camera for repair and then gave it to fix the camera. We did a video on it. We changed the battery um, to take 1.5 volt batteries. We also cleaned the prism in this, so um, afterwards he gave it to me, and it's really important to me like that. And then also it is his favorite 35 millimeter camera too, and it is a joy to use. It's really small, it's really compact, and it just takes really great photos, so the lens on here is pretty amazing. And it is my go-to film camera. I just had a wedding I went to, and this is what I used on that wedding to take pictures. And um, can't talk highly enough, highly enough about it, and when people ask me about um, film cameras and which ones they should get. I recommend the K1000 first and then if you're gonna step up the OM-1 because it is a beast and I love it. Camera number four is a really cool and it's my favorite camera to travel around with. It's a medium format camera and the top is a little broken and it's hard to use but it takes really great pictures and it's the only thing I have that's medium format that's pretty affordable so um, this is the one I take around when I'm trying to take sh street shots or just the things I really care about. It's 12 shots per roll. It's about $16 a process, but still really good and I still really enjoy it. 